Hey, what's going on YouTube? Sean Star 86. Um, doing an unboxing video of my Optica uh, VM100 video condenser shotgun microphone. Um, again, this is from Optica. They make good uh, lenses, uh, sound equipment, camera bags, uh, everything that you can think of that has to do with filmmaking or studio equipment type stuff. So, um, this mic is almost identical to the um, Rode video mic. Um, the same design, same style, everything. Maybe a tiny couple little different features, but um, this is basically the same exact thing. Um, the only difference, the big difference, is um, this mic costs $79.99 on eBay. And uh, brand new, the brand new Rode mic cost about 160 to 180 so um depending on where you look online um i got this for let's see i had like four dollars in ebay credit so it was a little cheaper than um that price that i told you one uh i'm 79 dollars i'm sorry and um yeah so uh it's the optica vm 100 shotgun microphone it's a highly sensitive directional microphone Designed to magnify your target sounds while eliminating background noise from your video shoots. I'm pretty sure the um, the mic on the T2i is horrible. That's why I got this thing. So um, bear with me on the audio that you hear right now. But um, got to make do with what I have for right now until I put this on. So uh, the VM100 will attach to camcorders, digital SLR via shoe mount, which is the little piece under here um straight bracket or video rig and may also be mounted onto a boom pole via 3 8 or 1 8 threads <clears throat> it's a directional shotgun mic uh, noise reducing suspension system which is the uh, rubber bands that it has on it it's got a pad switch includes a standard standard and outdoor windscreen which is this right here which is pretty cool which is also known as a they call them dead cats it's a windscreen for outside for the uh, air if it's really windy. Um, so yeah, let's open this thing up. It's brand new and uh, see what we got. I bought this from a guy on eBay. His name is, let's see, 47th Street Photo. I ordered lenses and a couple other uh, things off of them before. So um, these are, you can trust these people. They're pretty good. Uh, they ship like uh, maybe like three or four days. You'll get your box or whatever you order in the mail. So let's open this thing up. All right, so, so Mike, let's get this out the way before we get to that because that's the main, the main thing. We have some extra rubber bands right here. This is the uh, windscreen, which is also known as the dead cat. Let's get that out the way. Some papers. Actually, it's a product guide right there so I'm gonna need a uh, 9 volt battery which is okay because I already have one up somewhere upstairs in my desk so um, here we go here is the main feature all right so let's open this thing up it's very lightweight um, it's pretty big to put on a Canon T2i but um, I'm sure it's gonna look a little funny Funny slash professional for some reason. I don't know why. But um, it's kind of light. Um, it's pretty sturdy. It's got the nice uh, rubber bands on there to shock absorb uh, the sound, I guess. If it's like a little wobbly, you're running through a scene and you're filming. It's got the uh, rubber bands right there, as I told you earlier. It's come, you know, it comes with the extra ones just in case. Um, on and off switch right here. Let's see if you guys can see that. Um, optical logo made in China. This is where the 9 volt battery goes in there. This is the uh, the jack that goes into the camera. The horseshoe right here, which screws onto the top of the um, Canon T2i. And this is the um, the padding over the microphone with the optical logo on both sides. This slides right off. Yeah, this is the uh, microphone right here. This slides on and off. I'm not sure if I'm going to put this over top of the um, cushion right here. But um, 
if anything, I could just take this off and slide this on. All right, um, so yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, besides the dead cat going over top of the microphone. Let's take this off of here, pull this on. I think it goes the other way around with the, um, this comes off of here. Yeah, it's too loose to be like this by itself. So I'm pretty, I'm 98% sure that this stays on and this goes over top of it. It's going to be a tight fit. Let's see if I can get in there. No dirty thoughts, guys. All right. Yeah, it's going to be a tight fit. So I'm going to have to squeeze it on. Maybe I can um, twist it on just like that. Without this catching on to the... There we go. Alright, so it goes something like this. Not 100%, but um, the Velcro straps clo closes like that. And um, that's the windscreen. Could fit on there more, but I don't want to mess with it and rip anything. I want to take my time with it. So it goes on like that. Looks kind of funny. Actually, it does look like a dead cat. Maybe a dead mouse or rat. But um, anyway, yeah. That's all for this video. So comment, rate, and subscribe. And let me know what you guys think. So, um, oh, yeah. I'm going to do a review of this after I use it for a little while. So um, stay tuned. And uh, that's why you should subscribe right here. Because you're going to see the review. Alright, let me know what you guys think, and I'll talk to you guys later. Peace!